phones, tablets, TVs, laptops and watches. Everything has become touch now. So why not make a touch doorbell? Let's start by designing the circuit first. The circuit uses two transistors, three resistors, one capacitor and a relay. And of course, a power supply. Here, the first transistor is used for pre-amplifying and the second transistor is used for operating the relay. Here, the resistors are used for current limiting and the capacitor across the relay eliminates flickering of the relay. Now let's start connecting the circuit on a breadboard. Take care of the pins of the relays while connecting the circuit. I have set the power supply voltage to 12 volts as I am using a 12 volts relay here. After the circuit is finished, switch on the power supply and slightly touch the other end of the theta ohm resistor and you'll hear a clicking sound of the relay, like this. If you wish, you can replace the relay with a DC doorbell or a DC buzzer which can directly operate from the power supply. Here, I am using an AC doorbell so I am using a relay to operate that AC doorbell. Let's try with a DC buzzer. As you can see, this also works fine. Now let's proceed with our AC doorbell circuit. I have soldered all the components on a PCB here and I also secured the back end of the PCB with some insulation tape to avoid any short circuits. Now let's connect the AC doorbell. Here I am using this small buzzer kind of an AC doorbell. Along with this, we will also need some AC wire and a 2 pin plug. First, let's connect this 2 pin plug to one end of this AC wire. And from the other end of the wire, we connect one wire directly to the buzzer, like this. And we secure the joint with some insulation tape. The other end of the buzzer is connected to the one end of the relay. And the other end of the relay is connected to the other AC wire. After connecting, secure all joints with some insulation tape. Now the circuit is complete. I will switch on the power supply and the buzzer and touch the end of the wire. As you can see, it's working great. That's all for today. If you like this video, you might like some of my other videos too. Please check them out at Electronics Media's channel. Till then, I'll see you in my next video.